Are we actually in a recession? Our times are here. Inflation is at a turning point. A recession. Recession. The recession we're living through right now will probably be the worst that our generation will ever see. And you can either exploit the current climate or face a very challenging few years. It's that clear. We are right on the cusp of a once in a lifetime opportunity to build generational wealth right now. And if you don't do something about it, you're just gonna get left behind because the financial gap between the rich and the poor is only going to get bigger, bigger than it's ever been before. And let's not even get started with inflation, which is at 8.5%. That means everything is more expensive. That means the cost of living crisis. And if you're in a job right now, do you really think you're gonna get a pay rise to compensate for this? Of course not. Look, today I wanna to show you how you can completely 180 your finances right now. I've been in situations where I was in thousands of pounds of debt. I couldn't afford rent, I was living paycheck to paycheck, I was even living out of my friend's spare room. I've been broke and I managed to turn it around by myself. And if you're watching this, you're at an advantage right now. You're living in the information age. Everything you need to be successful is available to you in abundance online. I'd put money on the fact that a handful of you watching this will become millionaires in the next few years because of the opportunities that this recession will bring. And if you want even a chance for one of those people to be you, listen up to what I'm about to tell you. It's time to be a player not a member of the crowd. It's time to stop watching videos on how to start a business and actually do it. In 2017, I was in this exact position. I would spend an hour every single day watching videos about other people's success. I would always have an excuse as to why the time wasn't right for me or why I couldn't start right now. I was just plodding along with my job, waiting for the right idea, waiting for something to change until enough was enough. You know, in the past three months alone, half a million people have watched my videos. That's not total views, that's half a million individual people. How many of those do you think have taken the plunge yet? 1%? Less? It's so easy to just grab your popcorn and watch the game unfold, let somebody else play. But when is enough enough? for you. Because if it isn't right now, you're going to be beating yourself up for the rest of your life. Because someone else would have stopped making excuses and they would have just taken the plunge before you did. Did you know that Airbnb, which is now valued at 31 billion, was built in the last recession of 2008? The founders had an idea of renting an airbed, literally an air mattress, hence Airbnb, in their living room. And at the end of that year, the world descended into an international recession and the pair saw it as an opportunity to expand. Airbnb literally took over the short-term living market as people were being outpriced by hotels who were making up for shortcomings in revenue because of the recession, which ironically is what's happening right now. They took advantage of the situation and they didn't use it as an excuse like most other people did. Did you know Disney was also founded in one of the worst financial crises in history, the Great Depression? Walt and Roy Disney created cartoons and they wanted to bring happiness, of course, to people who were suffering from the economic crisis. And one of those cartoons was Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs, I'm sure you know it. That alone made around 1.25 million during the period. Disney is now worth $180 billion. You might not make the next Airbnb or Disney or have the same level of success that they had, but what if you could even gain 0.01% of their success? And I'll tell you right now, that is possible. And you don't even need a big idea, a big break. We are literally in the information age. Opportunity is f***ing everywhere. I made a video a few weeks ago with 50 business opportunities you can explore. Literally 50 business models, tangible business models that you can explore right now. But that's not to say all of them are recession-proof or recession-worthy but there is so much opportunity. What you need right now is something with a low barrier to entry that provides solutions that people actually need during a recession. And what do people need the most? Financial security. So if you can help people achieve financial security through whatever business you launch, you're ahead of the game. My main source of income is a marketing agency. I use Facebook ads to help companies make more money. It's a very simple business model and a very simple skill. It makes me over $100,000 a month. It made me my first million, bought me a house, a supercar, and allowed me to literally handcraft the life I always wanted. I didn't even know how to run Facebook ads when I first started. Nobody teaches you that shit. You have to go out there and learn things for yourself. Let's take me for an example, right? In 2017, I simply wrote a list of all the things I didn't understand about Facebook ads. It was essentially a desired lesson list for a hypothetical online course. I literally then, one by one, searched those topics on YouTube and one by one, I crossed them off my list. Now, if you can't find the information you need on YouTube, just go over to Google, right? You'll be so shocked at how much information is out there for free. 
that most people don't even want to learn new skills. It's easier for them to sit on their asses and do the same shit that they have always done. But that's only gonna keep you where you've always been. And the truth is, if you wanna be financially free during this recession, you need to do something that's already been proven. You need to start a solution-focused business. You need to learn a new skill. A skill that helps other people gain financial security. A skill like Facebook ads, TikTok ads, email marketing. I don't really care what skill you offer as long as that skill has high returns in the shortest amount of time possible. The weak and the unskilled will be the first ones to struggle. And if you don't have a high value skill right now, you need to start learning one. You don't even need to be a master, right? You just need to know enough to get results. And it really is that simple. And I'm not saying it's gonna be easy because it's not. You're gonna have to put in work. You're gonna have to make sacrifices. But if you ain't prepared to do that, someone else will be. Someone else will take your success. Someone else will live the life that you keep promising yourself that you're gonna live. Are you really just gonna stand aside and let that happen? No, enough is enough. It's your time. So from today, not tomorrow, today, I want you to pick one thing from your life that's costing you time. One thing that's costing you time every single day. Be it Netflix, be it going out, be it porn, be it TikTok, and get rid of it. No excuses. At first, spend that time thinking about your next move. Thinking about that skill that you're going to learn. And don't overthink it here. You'll gravitate towards something based on your experiences, based on your knowledge, based on what other people that you trust are already doing. So pick that skill and then invest your time every single day into learning it. Because that one single skill is your vehicle to financial freedom in 2023. You're not gonna become rich overnight and it's certainly not gonna be easy, but nothing worth having is easy. Now, if you don't know where to start, I made a video that'll teach you how to start a skill-based business right now. The best way to make your first $100,000 cash during this recession. In that video, I even reveal how you can avoid learning these skills yourself. You can pay other already skilled people instead. But I'm getting ahead of myself. So click the link around here to watch the video now.